Hey, we're gonna make some tandoori chicken today in this Big Easy Oilless Fryer. One of our subscribers, Steven, messaged us on Facebook and said, can you make some tandoori chicken in that Big Easy Oilless Fryer? And if you don't have one of these tandoori ovens, who does? The Big Easy is probably the closest commercial product you can get to replicate it. My chicken's been brining overnight, just a gallon of water and um, a cup of kosher salt, okay? Just going to try to wipe off if there's any excess salt laying around on this chicken. Okay, we got that water off of it. Now let me just finish wiping this guy off. And I'm going to score this chicken, all right? And the reason is to let this awesome seasoning and marinade get down into every little crevice. And, well, I shouldn't say every little crevice. But I should say we'll have more surface area for this um, marinade to seep in. Okay. Now, let's get this marinade ready, okay? What I've got here, two cups of Greek yogurt, and I got three tablespoons of uh, olive oil. What I got here is the juice from one, li uh, one lemon. Last I checked, lemons were yellow, not green. Okay, now, what I got here, all kinds of good stuff. Right? We got fresh ginger, garlic, gram marsala, cashmere, chili powder, coriander, turmeric, cumin, fenugreek leaves, and then I got a little red chili pepper paste. What we're going to do is put all that in here, like so. Then we're going to make sure it gets all mixed up really, really well. Now I got my chicken back here, okay, and what we're going to do now is work this uh, yogurt marinade all over it, okay. I'm going to put it in a pot here, and um, get the rest of it. And you can see that chicken's not looking too sexy right now, but we're going to put it in the refrigerator, let it marinate five to six hours, I believe it'll be okay chicken has been marinating five hours okay now first time i've made this right uh, but from what i read we don't want all this you know big globs globs whatever the word is of this marinade on it so i'm just going to try to uh, wipe a bunch of it off and as soon as i get that done we'll pick this right back up All right, so we got this chicken uh, wiped off. And let me get one pair of these gloves off because what I want to do now is season this guy up. I got some more of that red cashmere uh, chili pepper that we used in the marinade. I'm just putting a little on here for color, okay? If you'll notice when you get this in the restaurant, right, tandoori chicken, it's always kind of red. I don't know what they do in restaurants, but I do know that a lot of recipes call for food coloring and I don't want to use food coloring and I'm uh, just guessing but I'm guessing authentic doesn't have food coloring but by the way if you know all about authentic uh, tandoori chicken leave me a comment down below I'd love to learn more about it what little I have uh, picked up was from researching on the internet right wonderful internet okay so we're just going to get him, you can see, I'm not putting a lot. This might have been a tablespoon or so. Just like I said, looking for the collar, okay? And I don't want to waste that last little bit, so I'm going to put it on there. All right, let's get this basket and get it in the Big Easy. Okay, I got this Big Easy. The propane is turned all the way up. The temperature control, or the it's not really temperature control, the control that... Uh, allows the propane to come into the Big Easy. I've got it wide open. 
been about one hour, 50 minutes. Look at that chicken. Is that chicken not looking delicious? She's probing 166 in the breast. Let's get it off here. Chicken's been resting here about 10 minutes. Look at the collar. Look at it. Take that leg off. Look at that. I don't know if you can see that in the video. It is so, so juicy. Look at the juice coming off of that chicken. Wow, it's still good and hot. All right, so I want to get some of this skin, some of this chicken. Let's dive in. Mm. Skin is perfect. Crunchy. Flavor is awesome. I know some of you don't like spice. Okay, this is not spicy. Not spicy. Oh man. I, I hope that comes up in the video. There is just so much moisture in that chicken. Look at that. I gotta tell you, thanks Stephen for recommending that we uh, cook this. Never did it before. Had to do a lot of research. Sorry, I'm talking with my mouth open. I would definitely go to the time and effort again to make this.